What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. It's Ju Gray here. And if you are not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe down below. The videos that I produce on this channel are inspirational, motivational, and a lot of law of attraction things as well as fashion stuff. But today we are going to be talking about manifesting your desires and my personal tips on what I do to speed up the process and to manifest everything that I want in my life. So if you're interested, keep watching. Alright y'all, so my very first tip is no secret at all. I talk about this a lot on my channel. And it is my gratitude journal. So I feel like the real key, the real key to manifesting anything you want in your life is to show appreciation and to show gratitude. Inside my gratitude journal, I write down things that I'm grateful for. You can pick and choose the amount that you want, but I personally write 10 things that I am grateful for every single day. Now, every single day, like it gets kind of gets kind of tough you wonder like well something new what am i grateful for today that's new that i didn't say yesterday or i didn't say two weeks ago and so it really causes you to think and to really like dig deep and to figure out what is it that i'm truly and fully grateful for so after i do my 10 things that i'm grateful for i write down daily affirmations every single day i write down about i don't even know how many but it's a lot uh, I want to say about 25 affirmations and I write down things that are really motivating and things that I really want to um, become. Things that I, if I'm not already that I want to become more of or just become period. So for example, I think a lot of people get confused with affirmations and you just write things down like I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy. Well for me affirmations mean something a lot different for me i write down affirmations like i am a successful business owner i am a um i don't i don't like telling y'all everything so i try to keep it like very basic but this is something that you also can write i do this is the first thing that i write i am a money magnet so for me those are the type of affirmations that i write i'm a money magnet i i attract money to me i am a grateful person i write things like that down in my affirmations right under my affirmations i write down daily goals now these are things maybe like a to-do list things that i have to do in my day things that i need to do like within the week and i just procrastinate and i keep putting off and so every night when I'm like about to go to sleep, I look at my journal and I check off my goals. Like, did I accomplish the goals for the day? So I also write in here, um, I think I write in here when I start to get like a little antsy and I start to get um, impatient. I start to rewrite my goals down. And the key thing about writing down my goals in here is that I write them in the present tense. I do not write things like I will be a successful entrepreneur. I write I am a successful entrepreneur, speaking it into the now, speaking it into the present. And so I definitely suggest writing down your goals, revisiting your goals, if not weekly, definitely monthly. I know for me, I probably visit my goals about once a month, maybe twice a month. And so I'm scratching things off my goal list. I'm adding things on the goal list. And this is something that I keep safe, like I keep this everywhere I go, wherever I'm at or traveling, I keep my gratitude journal with me because it's just so powerful to write down your thoughts, which brings me into my next tip, tip number two, write down everything. You can't just think in your mind, you know what, I want to be a millionaire or you know what, I want a new car. Uh, you gotta write it down. It's something about, I've talked about this too on my channel a lot. It's something about thinking things and writing it down and speaking it that all of it just combines and manifests. So, think it, write it, speak it. Those are also within like the affirmations, speaking your affirmations. Another tip I want to talk about, tip number three, is to be extremely specific. So if one of your goals is to get a new car, don't simply write down, I want a new car. No, you have to write, for example, I have a brand new blank, blank, blank. So for me, uh, it's on my vision board, it's on my phone. I have a vision board on my phone as well. I have on my phone a Lexus RC 350 2018 black on black, like extremely detailed and specific. It's a Lexus Coupe. And what's funny is that the car that I'm driving now was on my vision board three years ago. So... It shows like it really does work manifesting. So be specific, definitely. 
Another tip that I have, tip number four, is scripting. I also do that here in my journal. So this doesn't just act as a gratitude journal, it acts as like a diary, a goal book, a planner, it's like everything wrapped into one. So I do a lot of scripting and with scripting it's also speaking it into the now, speaking in the present. So for me, um, as you all know, like I did my how I attracted my man or manifested my man, I did a lot of scripting with him when I wanted to manifest him back into my life. And so now that I'm single, and I'm ready to mingle. I'm just kidding. Now that I'm single and I want to attract somebody completely different and completely new into my life, I am doing scripting again. And so the scripting, I'm speaking in the present. I have, now I want, now I will have, now I will meet. I have a 6'2 brown skin man, all of that. So. That's just an example of scripting as well. I also script for like job opportunities. I script for my, um, like just my daily life, like how I see my life, uh, like my day to day life. So for example, again, I hate like reading this y'all cause I feel like it's just my personal business, but I feel like I have to give you an example. So here's one that I wrote. I am a successful entrepreneur. I am a creator and a creative person. I wake up with the intention of motivating and inspiring people. I am a successful business owner. I am a partnered, I have a partnered share with blank. I won't say their name. Um, I have the ability, I have the ability to travel and live authentically. I have the ability to take care of my parents and I have, I'm in love with the most amazing man. So that is my scripting that I do. I can get a lot more specific, which I have in here somewhere, I just can't find it. But I can get really specific in the terms of like my day. Like if I was to plan out my day, I wake up at this time, I do this at this time, I go here, I'm able to do this. So being specific, scripting, um, all of these things like tie into each other. Another tip that I have, I kind of lost count, I don't know if you're on number five or six. But another tip that I have is to visualize. Every single night, y'all, I visualize. I close my eyes right before I go to sleep and I really just picture in my mind how I see my life, how I see my day-to-day -day living, who I see myself with, what I see myself doing, where I see myself living. So all of those things I just visualize and I take a moment to just thank God for everything in my life that I already have. And I also thank him for what's coming because I know I know for a fact all the stuff that I'm doing is gonna come. Another tip that I have for y'all that I've done videos on is creating a vision board. You can see my vision board behind me. I also just created a vision board for my phone and I just use the app PhotoGrid. And with PhotoGrid, I just put pictures, random, not random, but pictures of things that I want in my life. And so I put that on here and I created a vision board. So anytime I open my phone, I unlock my phone, this is the first thing that I see. And it's just like a reminder. Sometimes I'll just be looking at my phone in the middle of the day and I'm just like, thank you, Lord, for all of these things that's coming to me because everything on my vision board, I know I'm going to try it. Um, last but not least, my last tip is to read and to read positive things. I just posted a video, my last video, I posted um, current books. And a lot of the books that I read are extremely positive. The Alchemist, I read Law of Attraction books, um, The Secret. There's, let me just look to the right. Um, the Wisdom of Sundays by Oprah. There's just a lot of positive books that I read. And all of those books guide me. All of those books encourage me and make me believe and make me know, they affirm that I will be getting everything that my heart desires. So if you have been feeling like you are stuck, lost, don't know what to do, give the law of attraction a shot. Um, I think a lot of people run away from the law of attraction because they think it's just like whatever. But in my opinion, the law of attraction works. It's worked for me on many occasions. Like everything that I have ever wanted and really put positive energy into, I've gotten in my life. So I highly suggest looking it up. Um, practicing things, believing, having strong, strong belief, and just knowing, being positive, knowing that everything that you want is going to get answered by God, the universe, whatever you believe in. I hope it was inspiring and I hope that you learned something and I hope that I've encouraged you to start a gratitude journal yourself. 
And I hope that I have encouraged you to try to manifest your desires and manifest the things that you want in your life. Whether it's a new job, a man, a car, um, money, a new living situation, whatever you want, you have the control and the ability to make it happen. So go out there, get a gratitude journal, read, be positive, be happy, and I will definitely see y'all in the next video.